Hello. Welcome to the Detroit Experience. I'm an android and I'll be your hostess. For a long time, robots, or rather the concept of mechanical humans, have been the thing of science fiction and no one would have ever believed that a human-like machine could ever exist that could perform any task and function just like a normal human being. But can something like a human robot ever exist? Are we capable of creating such a human that could perform all the tasks like a human? Is such a thing even possible? Continue watching the video till the end to know more. As the concept of artificial intelligence advances each day, the products built with the help of this technology have also been making quite the headlines. These mechanical shenanigans have been created with the idea of human-machine interaction and to provide help to us humans in order to execute repetitive and menial tasks. These robots can one day be more useful than us human beings and can provide a lot more than what humans can do in the field of hospitality, logistics and healthcare. Here is a list of top 10 humanoid robots of this year, with the first one being named as Parkour. Yes, this robot, as the name suggests, can perform parkour tricks just like a real human. Parkour is an excellent sandbox from the Atlas team at Boston Dynamics in order to experiment their new behaviors. There have been videos of this robot that have been spread all over the internet, where the video demonstrates how the robot works along with their whole body athletics, maintaining its balance through a number of rapidly changing, high-energy activities. Through jumps, balance beams and vaults, the company has demonstrated that they take their team to its limits in order to discover and innovate the next generation of mobility, perception and athletic intelligence in the field of robotics. Coming up at number 2, we have the robot that has taken all over the internet with its lovable experience visualized in the movie Avengers. Yes, we are talking about the one and only Groot. The research and development team of the Disney Labs, commonly known as the Imagineering Team, has been doing extremely well with innovation in the robotics field. From making stunt doubles and lifelike Na'vi to skinless weirdos, they have got it all covered. However, their latest creation seems like a robot that has literally walked out of a movie. Yes, this robot is none other than the most famous and loving Groot from the Avengers. It's a bipedal robot that is capable of walking slowly without any strings or control wires attached. TechCrunch's Matthew Panzarino has the lowdown on this robotic milestone for Disney. They have been trying to develop automatically steered autonomous robot actors for its parks. Under the name of Project Kiwi, the engineers of the company have been spending years creating their own bipedal freestanding robotics platform as a part of the company's long-term effort to power robots like the Groot. The gait is smooth, the arms swing in a lifelike manner and the feet plant realistically. The body sways exactly as you'd expect it. There's no other way to see it. It's ambling, says Panzerina. Number 3. We have a robot that goes by the name of Ida. Have you ever heard of a robot that can paint, and on top of that, paint better than a human? Ida isn't just a robot, and she isn't just an artist. She's what her creators call the first ultra-realistic humanoid artist, and her talent is undeniable. We haven't spent eye-watering amounts of time and money to make a very clever painter, said Ida's creator, Aidan Meller. This project is an ethical project. Introduced in 2019, Ida is a poet, a painter, and a sculptor. In addition to robotic arms, she also has an incredibly realistic face, complete with blinking eyes that scan the room. Up next, we have reports from the University of Tokyo in Japan that believe that they have been successful in making the first ever working humanoid finger successfully covered in complete living skin. Our skin model is a complex three-dimensional matrix that is grown in situ on the finger itself, said Professor Shoji Takeuchi, one of the lead authors of the study. This finger is able to bend, stretch, and keep its shape intact just like a regular finger can. And the skin can even heal if damaged with the help of a collagen bandage and so long as it is in liquid. The researchers believe that this can be the beginning of further innovating this sort of technology that can aid in medical research on skin damage, such as deep wounds and burns, and can as well help in advancements of manufacturing. Number 5. We have the Pepper Robot. This robot has been designed to perceive and acknowledge human faces, and is also capable of detecting different types of human emotions. This enables it to make interactions with humans through artificially intelligent conversations, gestures, and its touchscreen. It is a robot that is built with the thought of human-robot interaction and to evolve social bonds between the two beings. That is, if robots could be called beings. Number 6 is the Nadine Robot. This robot is the closest to what a human is in the world. 
With a human-like body and lifelike features, Nadine is the closest to what a robot could be to a human. She is designed to even recognize you from your previous visit, shake hands, make conversation, keep an eye contact, and also make you believe that you are talking to a real human. It has depth cameras, a microphone, and a webcam to gather visuals and audio inputs. She is currently employed as a customer service agent at AIA Singapore Insurance Company. Number 7. We have Erika This is a human-like robot created and developed by Hiroshi Ishiguro from Intelligent Robotics Laboratory, Japan. It is developed in such a way that she can easily interact with human beings and make changes to her facial expressions according to the conversation being made. With built-in recognition abilities and speech generation algorithms to track the numerous faces in the room and to allow the robot to make various facial expressions accordingly. Currently, Erika has been working as a news anchor. Imagine watching early morning news and the presenter is a robot. Awesome, right? Number 8. This one goes by the name of Robocop. A startup from the city of Hyderabad, India has made a huge advancement in the field of artificial intelligence and machine learning by developing a new police robot in order to support the implementation of law, order, and traffic. With the recent reports which claim that the Chief Minister of Kerala has inducted the robot co-op at the state's police headquarter with the rank of a sub-inspector, the robot is capable of performing all the tasks at the police headquarter's front office. It has a set of sensors including proximity, ultrasonic, the temperature sensors that helps the robot to protect and secure office, malls, airport, etc. in order to ensure safety. Number 9. We have Junko Chihira, developed by Toshiba using the technology created by Hiroshi Shigeru, who also created Erika. With incredible interaction skills and a huge range of facial expressions, the robot is capable of greeting its guests and tourists in a wide range of languages, which include English, Japanese, and Chinese. The local tour guide is embedded with speech synthesis technology, machine learning and natural language processing which enable her to comprehend, process the information, and make accurate answers to the tourist questions. Junko specializes in making her tourists feel like home. And finally, number 10, we have Kemper. An artificially intelligent humanoid robot developed from scratch in Bengaluru by the Sirena Technologies. This robot is reported to be deployed at the Bengaluru Kempegovra International Airport, where the robot is supposed to greet and guide the travelers in Kannad and English as well. Before its launch, the robot was programmed to assist the passengers by providing information about their journey in a scrupulous manner. The working of the robot was unveiled by the Innovation and Technology Minister of Karnataka through a video on Twitter. Alas, we have come to the end of this video. Did we miss any of the robots that you are aware of? Do you think robots will be the future of automation? Will robots be the cause of unemployment of humans? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section down below. We would love to hear your thoughts on this while we keep working on making more such videos. Well, that brings us to the end of this video. We hope you have enjoyed watching the video. Please like the video if you have not already and make sure to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to press the bell icon to never miss another update from our channel. With that being said, let's meet in another one of these videos. Until then, see ya!